Hello, my name is Gabriel Saez. My candidate number is 1400. And today I'll be talking about my creative critical reflection question number three, which is how do your production skills develop throughout this project? Okay, so in the beginning, we, by our teacher, Mr. Soriano, we were more introduced into the types of shots that are used in movies and what are their purposes. So that was a little bit of our first introduction uh, to this project because, you know, we can't film a movie without not knowing any shots. So we had to first, we got, we, uh, he taught us that in class. And after that, we did a little bit of our own research depending on what genre we decided to use. So for example, my group, we did a film called Taken, which is a thriller about a businessman that um, gets retaliated because he cut off a boss, uh, a business boss from a deal. And I've said this in my previous critical, uh, critical re, uh, creative reflections, but I'm just saying it just in case. So throughout the project, we initially started, you know, deciding, okay, we set with Thriller, which is the genre we decided to go with. And we had to basically just film across and just figure out what shots we decided to use. In the beginning, it was kind of complicated because uh, based on our schedules, we couldn't really like plan it through for to have a set filming day. But we did effectively have group meetings in school talking about, okay, when we do film, what shots will we use? How will, what scenes will we have? We created a script. So I feel like that was a good place to start for our skills. And the first filming session we had lasted about three hours. And to be honest, I'm pretty proud and impressed with my group. I mean, mainly me because I was the cinematographer. So the shots were mainly on me based on production. But even with set design, which was and editing and directing, which were all jobs assigned to my other group members, we all did a pretty good job all together of getting this project well thought and done. So basically as the day went on in our filming, we had to do a couple of retakes because we're not professionals. So we had to do double takes and all that kind of stuff because the acting wouldn't come through right or like the shots will be a little shaky or some minor stuff like that. Like for example, I mentioned in my blogs that there was, when we published our rough draft before we like did any changes prior to finalizing our film, there was a shot that literally I would shake the camera a lot and we had to do a retake of that and another filming day. And also I feel like the most difficult was probably the night scene based on the fact that we were just in a random neighborhood and we had to take shots and people would just look at us weird because we're just some kids filming a movie, but this our skills were already pretty well developed and we managed to do it in a pretty short amount of time. So, and the shots I think came out to deliver the message we wanted to deliver in our film. So I think uh, the production skills we developed were good throughout our filming process and it couldn't have been better. So that'll be all for my third critical, creative critical reflection question. And thank you for listening.